Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Ken Domic food review just for you. I am in the very, very pretty town of Port Carling, Ontario, Canada at a brand new Tim Hortons location. One of the coolest Tim Hortons location I think I've ever seen in my life. They have an indoor fireplace and an outdoor fireplace for in the winter time when the snowmobilers come by they can drop by the Tim Hortons here in Port Carling and grab themselves a coffee and and sit on their snowmobile and sit outside in front of the fireplace very very cool way to go Tim Hortons so today I thought I would do I actually came into town from the cottage just to do their brand new latte and their latte machines broken are you kidding so I looked in their shelves and they had this, which I'm not, I don't think I've done this before. It's the Nanaimo, Nanaimo bar donut. Uh, I think I've done something similar to this. I may have done it before. I apologize if I have done it already, but I thought I'd try it, give it a shot. And I also grabbed myself a medium coffee, double, double, of course. It looks like we have Nanaimo bar crushed up on top of the donut in with all the icing and then they've injected it with some type of a cream let's take a bite of this see if it's any good i'm gonna get my coffee ready because i'll need it with this donut it's gonna be sweet okay here we go let's take a bite i'm just want to see where we should bite this from okay right here it smells like it smells like um just a, a little hint of coconut it just smells like it just a little bit when I got like a little whiff of it. Here we go. I recommend not eating this in your car. Very crumbly. As I'm biting it, yeah, it's got it's got like uh, crushed coconut bits. So we got like a bit of um, a white stuff inside. And I guess that's just another cream center. Let's try to get into that. I'm hoping that it's not the Tim Hortons Boston Cream Center inside this because I'm not too keen on their Boston cream. To me, Boston cream is supposed to be a custard inside a donut with chocolate on top. But uh, the Tim Hortons, I don't know what kind of custard they use. I just don't like it. That's, that's just the that way I feel. My mouth has been overpowered. My taste buds have been overpowered by the coconut uh, right now, this is just a coconut choc chocolate coconut donut for me. It's pretty good. I like it. I'm not. I'm not a crazy fan for coconut. I don't know. You know crushed coconut uh, on top of of food. I'm not. I'm, I'm not too crazy about that. Let me know in the comments below if you're the same. I love coconut. I love coconut cream pie. I love anything coconut flavored except that crushed shaved coconut that they sprinkle on food. I'm not too crazy about that. I don't know why, but anyway. Let's take another bite just to triple check and make sure. Lots of goo on that one. It's quite tasty. I'm digging it. The chocolate donut itself is perfectly moist, fresh, soft, and then you get that I'd say I'd say the biggest flavor kick is the coconut, and then you can start tasting the bits of the Nanaimo bar pieces in there as well. I'm not sure if this cream center justifies, because um, the, the regular Nanaimo bar center isn't like gooey like that. But I, I I can't even compare it to that. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna finish this off and I'll be right back to rate it. Are you ready? Hang on. All done, ladies and gentlemen. On my rating scale, I'm gonna give the Nanaimo bar uh, between an indifferent and a would recommend. It was really, really sweet. Really coconut flavored, like I keep saying. I apologize if I said it more than a thousand times. But there's other things that Tim Hortons makes that are way better than that. Uh, it's If you love the Nanaimo bar, then I would recommend it. But if you're like me and you don't like a whole lot of coconut in your donuts or your food, or whatever, then this would be uh, an indifferent to a would not recommend. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So once again, I'd love to thank you very much for stopping by my channel, checking out my videos. 
If you love my videos and it's the first time you've been by, please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss the next one and another really cool town like this. But if you enjoyed watching this video and you want to support KBD Productions TV, hit it with a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. ding. And we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic Food Review. Ken Domic out. Boop. Nanaimo. 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 They can drop by the Tim Hortons here in But if you love this video, but if you love this video and you want to show, hit it with a thumbs up.